Well, today in Nachtmarket or Nachtmarket in Vienna, I take this um, oscilloscope. But the thing that you should know, this oscilloscope not working with the frequencies. It's working just with voltage. The oscilloscope number is um, Clay Equipment D655. Excuse me, D65, and also the it's working uh, with voltage. This is the voltage gauge or the selector, starting from 50 millivolt and ending with 20 volts. Also going to 20 millivolt and 10 millivolts, but I believe that it will not work less than 50 millivolts because of it's a very noisy device you can see that I have a lot of interlace with the screen this is interlacing a screen and the new version of this kind of equipment are non interlace this is two probes not coming with this um, oscilloscope but also I find from the uh, Nacht market and it's also um, coming with two um, gauge X1 and X10 dependent to the um, voltage that we are going to work so um, this is the 10 on and off switch here We can see that uh, it's going to off when I'm turning off the wife. It uh, the inside of the oscilloscope is a lot of huge capacitors, electrolytic capacitors, and when I'm turning on and off, it needs some time to warm up. It's a really the equipment need the warming up, and also it's uh, the backlight. You can see. And also I'm able to adjust everything so to calibrate uh, this device we need to find exactly voltage reference not a normal reference we need exact uh, two three reference voltage at least to work with this selector and Calibrate this and 100% we need the um, Reference voltage to write down exactly or keep in mind the each part of this matrix the um, LCD is how big and What is exactly the scale that we are going to work with this oscilloscope? Two, two channel is here and the channel one can work in three steps DC grand and AC the second one exactly the same also the selector I told is the voltage starting 10 millivolts or minus 10 to 15 so I have two item to the line Position of the um, waveform here, you can see. And the second channel coming with reset push button when I'm pushing this button in the um, um, the position of the second um, channel going to factory reset or reset to the main configuration so this is the on and off switch when I'm going to activate or deactivate the channel and this is all that I have so here I'm setting up the frequency trigger speed and the time that will show exactly the scales 
but for the frequency I th I, I don't think I'm able to um, check the frequency by this so uh, it's job but but I'm able to check the waveforms how is, is the sine wave is triangle or what but uh, when I don't have any number it's really hard to know exactly the frequencies and it's very hard to find this but in for the new digital or analog scopes is much easier to find exactly what is the frequency to vogue and exactly what's going on i will try to uh, calibrate and work more with this equipment and make one more video thanks for watching and goodbye